Hi everyone. Um, I promised some meditations this summer and here I am with our first meditation. We'll begin with sound and then we'll move into Anapana Samadhi meditation and then we'll do some body awareness meditation. Okay? Alright, so uh, thank you for watching and uh, stay tuned for other meditations and also a pranayama practice that I promised, the Kapalabhati practice. I'll be sending out a link for that uh, videos as well. Okay, hope you enjoy the show. So take a comfortable seat, relax with the spine long, the lower back is slightly arched so that our hips are angled down toward the floor, knees are pointing down. If you're in a chair, just resting your hands on your lap or on your legs. If the legs are crossed in a seated position on the floor, or on a cushion, just relax the lower back. Let your belly kind of fall forward so the hips roll forward, angle down, so that it's easy to breathe naturally. Take a deep breath. Relax your shoulder blades down your back. Take another deep breath and let go of any tension that you have in your arms, shoulders, in the jaw. And just settle in and begin with sound, listening for sound outside the room. Like a laser, you can allow your awareness, full awareness, to go out to those sounds. being aware of natural and man-made sounds. Now we can begin bringing our awareness into the room, being aware of any sound inside the room or inside the building. Now begin to draw your awareness inside, perhaps hearing sound of the breath moving in and out. And now the practice of Anapana is increasing the breathing rate about double, so about 30 breaths a minute roughly. And we do this by just increasing the cadence of the air coming in and out of the nose. So about this cadence, breathing in, breathing out, breathing in, breathing out, breathing in, breathing out, breathing in, breathing out. And we're just keeping that pace And being aware of all our awareness being drawn to this faster than normal breathing. This cadence that heightens our awareness to the breath. 
Be aware how easy your attention is drawn to the breath as you keep it at this faster than normal pace. If you get lightheaded at all, you can lengthen the breath, maybe breathing in a little longer, exhaling a little more, breathing in a little longer. If your mind drifts away from the breathing, maybe increase the speed or the rhythm of the breath. We can increase the breathing rate or we can make the breath a little more forceful, exhaling more forceful, inhaling more forceful. Sometimes that'll bring our awareness back to focusing on the breath. Remember, the goal here is to keep all our attention on the breath. Every time that your mind begins to wander away from the breath is the opportunity for you to renew that awareness of the breath by increasing the breathing rate, bringing our attention back, to the breath and being fully aware that your mind began to wander. And if you have to do that a hundred times during the practice, that's the practice. Each time that you do this, your awareness of the breath increases. Each time that you do this, you increase the length of your focused awareness. And that's really the goal, is increasing the length of your attention on a single object. And here it's the breath.
the mind is restless and it keeps wandering, you can hold your breath for some time. As you hold your breath, this immediacy will come forward, this attention will stand forward, and it'll force you to focus. When you release your air, be aware of the air coming out of the nose, and then begin anapana again, faster than normal breathing. Now, let the breath naturally slow down. Find your natural breathing rate and bring all your awareness to the nostril area. So the inner rings of the nostrils, the inner walls of the nostrils. And we can extend our awareness of this area from the tip of the nose down the left nostril to the area just below the nose and above the upper lip and then keeping our awareness across just below the nose and above the upper lip to the right nostril and then all the way back up to the tip of the nose so there's this triangular area is where we're primarily focusing all our attention from the tip of the nose down the left nostril just below the nose above the upper lip and then across to the right nostril and then back up to the tip of the nose so this anywhere in this area where you might feel some sensation now at first you might feel the brush of the air moving in and out of the nostrils you might sense pressure of the air moving in and out. There may be some sense of sensation of the hairs inside the nose moving. You may sense temperature change, coolness or warmth of the air moving. There may be hundreds of different kinds of sensations that I haven't mentioned. There may be vibration, tension. There may be some experience of expansion and contraction. There may be an itchy sensation, a prickly sensation. There may be a sensation of energy, electricity running through an area. So any sensation at all that arises in this area, be aware of the sensation as it arises. And then just watch the sensation. Be aware of the sensation. See if it changes, if it moves. Become fully interested in that sensation, whatever it is.
all this time, now breathing at our natural breathing rate. And everyone's natural breathing rate might be a little bit different. And just finding the breathing rate that feels natural for you right now. Now as a strong sensation arises, we become aware there's a strong sensation. What is it? What does it feel like? What does a specific what does a specific sensation feel like? Can you name it? Is it changing? Is it getting stronger? Is it getting weaker? Is it just staying the same? And then does it dissolve? Does it change form? So completely becoming engulfed in analyzing the situation as it arises. We don't have to make anything happen, the sensation just arises, and we're present, we're paying attention to it. If the mind begins to wander, you can go back to Anapana, moving the breath faster than a normal pace. You can stay with this meditation, Anapana, moving the breath fast, or you can stay with natural breathing, being aware of the sensations within the nose area. It's your choice. Whatever works for you best, right now. <laughs> 